Hi, and welcome to the Penny Black Autumn Colouring Tutorial. Begin by inking up the same tree stamp, just the smaller girl image, using Memento Tuxedo Black ink and the Memento pen. This way you can be accurate to just get her hand and not the other girl. Then place some acetate onto the misty and ink up the leaf again. Stamp onto the acetate and then move the card so that the image of the leaf is in her hand. Ink up the stamp again and then stamp the leaf into position. Then take the vermilion pen and fuse for five seconds and colour from the middle out towards the edge. Repeat this process on both sides and add darker areas with the bullet nib for shading and shadows, and also where the fabric would crease. Add extra shadows as necessary. Then take the tangerine colour top and fuse onto the vermilion pen for five seconds and colour over the jacket again in the same way as you did before. Then without fusing go over the whole jacket with the vermilion pen. Fuse the bullet nib of the mellow yellow pen for three seconds and then colour in the lighter areas of the hair working from the dark towards the light areas. Then take the sand pen and fuse for four seconds and colour from light to dark on both sides of the hair. Then take the caramel pen and fuse the bullet nib for four seconds and add more depth and colour to the shaded areas of the hair. Use a flicking motion to get more of a hair effect. Repeat the process again with the yellow pen. And then go back over the whole image with the sand pen fusing for four seconds. Then colour the face using light peach with a two second fuse. Use the bullet nib of the olive pen to colour the pockets on the jeans. Colour some areas without fusing and then fuse for two seconds to colour the pocket. Then without fusing take the taupe pen and add in all the creases and shadows in the fabric. Then fuse for five seconds and colour from the centre out towards the edge of the trousers. Repeat this until all of the trousers are coloured. Take the caramel pen and fuse the bullet nib for three seconds and colour the sole of the shoe, making it darker towards the bottom where it touches the ground. Then use the bark pen and fuse for four seconds to colour the boots, again making it darker towards the bottom. Next place the tangerine colour top on top of the taupe pen for three seconds and colour in the first leaf, working from the edges back towards the centre. Place the vermilion colour top onto the olive green pen and colour the other leaf using the same method. Die cut the image using the snowflake stitch frame second largest size. Then stamp Hello Autumn from the Hello Autumn stamp set using the rich cocoa ink. Then take the taupe pen and fuse for six seconds and colour in the ground using a flicking motion as you work out towards the edges. Then fuse the sand pen for five seconds and colour in sections working from the outer edge towards the body. Fuse again and this time flick out from the inner edge outwards. Repeat this process until the whole of the background has been coloured. Your image is now complete and ready for mounting. Die cut the largest snowflake stitch frame from brown card and then use painted blooms to create a frame. 
Layer all elements together and place onto a 6 inch square card blank. Your card is now complete. Here is a list of all the materials that have been used in this project. Thank you for watching.